Hey guys, welcome back to Tucker Middleton. And today we're making a micro survival kit. Um, so yeah, let's get into it. So what I'm doing is I'm taking this little container that I found that I have, um, and that's how much space is in it. As you can see, not very much. So, what we're going to do here, is we're going to take this little kit, and we're going to, all, all the supplies over here, we're going to put them inside this little kit. So, the first thing we're going to do, we're going to take a band-aid. Let me turn this down one notch. There you go. Take one band-aid and we're gonna put it inside here. So we got that band-aid right there. And here's something I made. Um, this is cortisone. Um, for like if you have something that's itches really bad. And what I did is I took a straw. I saw this from somebody else. He was making a micro kit. And uh, he burned this uh, end of a straw. Burned two ends of the straw and like and squirted the stuff or put the stuff inside the straw. So it's really, actually really easy. I might have to add a part two to this. Um, but it's actually really easy. And then, so we're gonna put the cortisone in there. Got cortisone and some band aids. Um, I'm also gonna add a towelette in there for wiping things down. Moist towelette. We're gonna put that right in the bottom. So this is everything we have in there. Currently, we got cortisone, we got a band aid, and a moist towel. So, I'll get you a better picture of this at the end of the video. Okay, next thing I have is two Tylenol um, inside of here, two Tylenol and inside of straw again. It's very small. Put that in there. We're going to do two Q tips. I went ahead and grabbed two matches and put them in the straw too. And burned the two ends of it. We have Dronamine for motion sickness. Put those in there. They wouldn't fit inside the straw. I'm sure there's bigger straws. But. Um, I have some lint for fire starter. And then we're going to put, we don't want to mix that with the Dronamine, so we're going to put that in the back. So there's everything that's in our kit right now. Um, I'm also going to go ahead and add a small pencil sharpener and a tiny pencil. So I'm going to show you how to make these tiny pencils. You're going to take your knife. I've already started this a little bit, but you're going to make a cut about right there on your pencil wherever you want it to, however, depends on how small, you're just going to cut that pencil. I would go ahead and do that. I just splattered water everywhere. This knife's been outside forever. <clears throat> Make a cut. And then you should just be able to snap the pencil right in half. And there's your tiny pencil. And then you're just going to sharpen it with your knife. Or if you have a used the pencil sharpener like earlier, 
just do it that way with the tiny pencil sharpener. So here's the one we just made and here is the other one. But that's literally how easy it is. You just gotta cut a pencil to the size you want it. Take it like a small pencil sharpener or your knife and just sharpen it up. And then you can use the rest of the pencil for like just whatever you want. And then if you want you can make a smoother cut on the end. That's what I'm doing right now. Making a smoother cut. Okay, um, and that is it for now. I am going to make a part two. So, see ya.